After an impressive opening first half to their Liga Uber Eats campaign, Nice had the chance to extend their unbeaten run on the road to six matches in all competitions, and they travelled to face a Brest side fairly content in mid-table, having recovered from a poor start. Liberat had won six of their last eight games in the league after winning none of their previous 15, but were nonetheless eight points behind their high-flying visitors, who spent the win to break it second in the table. The visitors didn't hang around inside the first minute, Casper Dolbo pulling it back to the edge of the area, where Pablo Rosario was waiting, curling a first-time attempt low to Marco Bizot's left, and keep getting down well to push it out for a corner. Just over ten minutes later, after some persistent work on the left from Flavius Danieliuk, Justin Kluivert took the ball down the wing, holding off players and skipping past challenges, before cutting back and laying it off to Dolberg, who drilled one from the edge of the area and found the bottom corner. It's the fifth of the season for the 24-year-old Dane, but just his second since September. The three goals in the first four games this season maybe now a return to form. Perhaps flashbacks to the 4-0 thrashing by Montpellier for De Zakarian, but his side hit back, forcing a pair of good saves from Walter Benitez. First, Steve Mounier with a header from very close range. And then, after some good footwork by Romain Fevre, Jeremy Le Duiron testing the Argentinian again. Annelies Eglon's task was then made much trickier when Morgan Schneidlin received a straight red in just the 20th minute. Perhaps a harsh decision from referee Stephanie Frappard, but either way, a second red card at Nice for Schneiderlin, the fifth of his career. With a man advantage, Brest poured on the pressure. Christophe Erel with a strong header tipped over by Benitez. Christophe Galtier watching on. Another corner, another header, another save. This time Lucien Agume, the man denied. Visitors somehow clinging on to their one-goal advantage through to the break. Having been beaten 4-0 in their last home game, Brest had never failed to score in back-to-back -back games on home soil since their return to the top flight in 2019, and considering the siege upon the opposition goal, were surely confident of keeping that stack going. So into the second half, and Galtier deciding to substitute goalscorer Dolberg for fellow attacker Andy Delors. The Algerian absent from AFCON, having decided to put club before country and fallen out with manager Jamal Belmadi in the process. And still the onslaught continued. This time it was Brendan Chardonnay, only a Hisham Boudawi clearance on the line away from levelling. After withstanding pressure for almost an hour, finally a chance of their own for Nice. Amin Query picking up a loose ball and feeding a through ball for Delors. Striker keeping his cool and slotting underneath Bizot in the 79th minute to calm these nerves with his eighth of the season. Then, with Brest throwing everything forward in the final minutes, a counter attack for the 10 men. Having notched up his fifth assist of the campaign, Guiri deciding to do it on his own this time, making it nine that he's finished himself with a stunning strike to wrap up the points in stoppage time. Cannoning in off the post, Bizot absolutely helpless. Mobbed by his teammates. Galtier pleased with what he's seen, and rightly so. And the final whistle, a heroic performance from Benitez. 26 shots for the hosts, 10 of which were on target, but no goals. And so a fourth consecutive victory for Galtier's side, which moves them back up to second spot. Level again with Marseille on 36 points, what is beginning to look like a two-horse race for the best of the rest.